Hey everyone, it's Matthew Fieldhouse here. In this video we're going to talk about how do you find a Cisco IOS image to use in GNS3. I know some of you out there are finding it a bit difficult to find an IOS image, so I'm going to run through the three main methods really of getting yourself an image to use in GNS3. So number one is to copy the IOS from a real Cisco router to your PC using TFTP. So as we all know, Cisco routers become preloaded with the image that runs on them. So say for example you have a 2610 router and that will be running some kind of 2600 series IOS. If you search online for copy IOS using TFTP you'll find yourself some tutorials of how to plug your router into your PC. You can then copy that image over from your real router to your PC and then you can load that image into GNS3 you'll make sure you select your 2600 series and then you can pretty much just virtualize as many of those routers as you like it's really cool so the second method is search google for ios downloads okay so this is a little bit of a bit of a secret technique really because uh, cisco don't always like this because there's a lot of um ios images out there basically that are being distributed and yeah, search yourself, for, go on Google, search for uh, maybe 2600 iOS download in Google. I'm sure you'll be able to find some. It's not the best and most legit way to go about getting your Cisco iOS images, but if you're desperate and you want to get your CCNA, then, you know, go for it. Step number three, download from the Cisco website using a service contract. Service contract is when a big company has... Uh, an agreement or they might have like a, a contract that they pay for on a monthly or a yearly basis with Cisco for support and once Cisco um, have been paid this money you can go to their website and you can download yourself some of their iOS images that's a really cool way of doing it because you get all the latest versions and it's a completely legit way of doing it you're not breaking any rules there but the other problem is that the service contracts are really expensive you only usually find them in big companies who spend a lot of money on Cisco kit. So, you know, choose one of those three methods, see which is best for you. Another cool tip is if you've got a friend who works at a company, ask them if you can use an IOS image, or maybe go into the forums online, chat with the guys on there, become friends, maybe they can send you one via email, and so on. So if you like this video and you want to watch more GNS3 videos, click the link below go to the GNS video training website and I'd like to thank you for watching.